Good afternoon, happy Thursday, and more importantly, happy Barbenheimer Day. Today is the official release date for both Oppenheimer and Barbie. I'm not seeing either of those today, unfortunately, but I will be watching them later this weekend, so make sure to follow me on Instagram at jplan 21 That's usually where I review all of the movies I watch. I still need to see Insidious. It came out uh, like a week and a half ago, I want to say, but I didn't get to watch it. Of course, today we're back at Universal, and uh, we're gonna have some fun. It's a pretty last minute trip. I woke up at 4 p.m. today. I'm just exhausted. This week, we've been going hard on YouTube. We've been living almost every day. We've been posting almost every day, and I feel like today's gonna be pretty chill. All right, just made it into the park. Just a thought I've had for a while, but they should definitely switch up the biometric scan. So instead of having to put your finger on, on the little blue light, they should just switch it to what Disney does and make them take your pictures so that way you don't have to run into any issues. It'll make the process so much faster as well. So today's trip was so last minute. I brought my backpack, but nothing in the backpack. So I have my phone battery charger in there, but not the cord. Um, I brought my camera, but not the SD card. So I'm using my backup SD card. I always leave one in case, but it's only 64 gigs. They're having a special event over in the plaza. I feel like one of these days I need to rent out the plaza and have my own JP Land event. No one's invited though, just me. I'll have the whole plaza to myself. Oh my gosh, but they do have characters walking around in the event. Beetlejuice is out. Uh, that's the only character I see. I like that they added an additional popcorn cart over here by the refreshment area of the plaza. I'm experiencing a little bit of FOMO. They have a DJ and everything. That's so awesome. Are you guys ready for Horror Nights? I am. Look at that. The maze is like almost done. The entirety of special effects is gone now, along with animal actors, of course, but this is, this is so weird. It looks like they dropped a bomb in the middle of animal actors and special effects. This is secretly an Oppenheimer marketing strategy. You guys keep telling me to do this. I did it yesterday. I walked through these like little tubes. It was not fun. They set up a red carpet just for me. Not complaining too much today. It's pretty cool out. I would say like mid 80s right now, but the breeze definitely helps. That's the last remaining piece of the special effects show. Everything at the lower lot is like 100 minutes. I wonder if they have the flaming mo today. They didn't, Barney drank them all. I feel like we haven't seen Marge or Lisa in a long time. Oh wait, there she is. There's only one left. Look at these mugs. They have circular playing cards over here. <laughs> What's up, Bart? How's your pops? He's good? Oh. Hug? Okay, we're going in for a hug. I have a joke for you. Why couldn't the bicycle stand up on its own? It was too tired. <laughs> you could steal the joke, tell Homer. He'll love it. All right. Good seeing you, dude. Bye. I feel like I could have given more energy, but you know, I'm, I'm a little tired. I gotta bring a donut for Homer. A little bit left of special effects. I wonder what they're gonna do with this Universal City sign. I'm sure they'll relocate it somewhere else. This is such an iconic sign. My Express has kicked in. I have no idea what ride to ride. Maybe Transformers, it might be nice and cool in there. Anything with air conditioning sounds good right about now. Holy cow, 
Transformers is 120 minutes though. A lot of my YouTube shorts are like really fun and silly. I made a really funny one over here in Nintendo World. You should go check that one out. I feel like no one ever talks about the plants in Nintendo World, or at least outside of Nintendo World. I love this little hub area. Toad is so cute. Mario and Luigi come out at 7 o'clock and the Mario Kart ride is 100 minutes right now. When are we getting our Yoshi meet and greet though? Maybe one day. I really want to buy the Toadstool plates. I just made it into the 1UP factory and they just brought in these new Super Nintendo World mugs which I love. Nothing too crazy going on inside of the mug itself but look at these awesome magnets they just brought in and I love these little Mario statues in front of the Super Nintendo World sign. What I especially love about it is, look at the plaque on the bottom, it says Grand Opening 2023. And they brought in a ton of new badge reels with Mario, Yoshi, Bowser, and Luigi. Now that they've brought in Toad into Super Nintendo World, the land feels a lot more complete. It was a very unexpected move by the park. Universal Studios Japan had it originally with the park opening but Universal Studios Hollywood brought Toad a little later. Let's see if this Mickey Mouse watch does anything. It doesn't, unfortunately. I noticed they added new vine sounds next to this piranha plant. So you can actually like hear it. It's so wild. We're always seeing friends in the theme park. We're here with Daniel Storm. Hey, let's Make sure go. to subscribe to his channel. He makes some quality content, great yes. videos. Uh, do you want to do you want to plug in your channel? I, I know I said Daniel Storm. I forgot yeah, the you numbers. Can just put it right there. Daniel Storm eighty nine here on the on the bottom. Of the there you screen. go. How, how's your day going inside of Nintendo World? Uh, been so good. I just met Toad for the very yeah. first time. Yeah. How'd you how'd you like meeting Toad? Awesome. He's so cute. He is. He is. He, how tall is he? Uh, he's kind of like around this uh, height, I would say. Oh, yeah, like for reference, this is how tall I am. How tall Daniel is? And then Toad is like this tall. Kind of like that. Did you, did you give him a hug? Yeah, well, yeah, kind of. I was like, kind of like, like okay. giving a handshake. Yeah, I gave him a hug the last time I saw him. He's so soft, so cute. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I just want to take him home. Oh my gosh. How <laughs> would we get Yoshi? I want Yoshi so badly. Yeah, Yoshi, I just don't know where they would put him. There's not much room in our counterpart of the land. Maybe if they ever expand the, the oh, land, man. they can they can add Yoshi later on. I want to see a Bowser meet and greet. Yeah, that would be yeah. cool. All right, Daniel Storm. Always nice seeing you in the theme park. I'll see you later. Right, see you later. Toad is leaving now. No. Bye, Toad. Aww. Okay. Well, I need to get in the habit of bringing my Power Up Band. I bought like three, but they're like 40 bucks each. So I don't know. I need to find a way to remember to bring my power up band because I feel like right now I could have been doing all the mini games because I, I really don't have an objective today, I don't have a goal. It would have been nice to just chill over here in Nintendo World. But I'm only chilling here for one reason and one reason only. It's nice and shady in here. The buildings around us are just so tall that the sun can't really hit us anymore. I sat down for a bit to relax and uh, waited for the sun to go down a bit because I wanted to walk into Nintendo World at night but uh, Optimus Prime and Bumblebee are out right now. The land is so beautiful at night. I wish I could always experience it at night. I guess I could come later on in the day, but I love going to Universal in the daytime. I love the hot weather, but the cool and like nice breeze is also refreshing. Yes, that's a reckless decision. I love it. Let's go ahead and open up these gates. Hi, Sunday. Blue bolt. Blue.
You know what? I'm gonna say screw it and take the stairs for this one. Just made it up to the top. Whew. That was light work. I could do this all day. I'm tired. Okay, well, I didn't bring my wand today, but I did bring a straw. So we, we might be able to duel one of these Death Eaters with the straw. This might work. This might work. Oh. Does this work? No? Oh. I don't think it works. Maybe it didn't work with that Death Eater. Maybe this one? I have the power. Of the dark side. Oh. Oh. I guess not. Well, I still think it's a good substitute if you don't have a wand. I have a wand, I just keep leaving it at home. I this is insane. Whoa. Oh my gosh, this kid is dressed up like Harry Potter. <laughs> 